Thank you, Zonda B. Welcome back to my channel. How you doing today? Are you doing good? Are you not doing good? Let me know because somebody will get beat up behind you, period. So in today's video, y'all, I am so scared because I will be going full 613 blonde. Like I know I just dabbled around with the little ombre blonde and the black roots, but the black roots kept it a little safe. This time, I will be working with a beautiful brand called Bow Fox Hair. The hair came in this beautiful pink package that I don't know, I love pink. On the package it says, Bow Fox Hair, focus on 100% human hair. Bow Fox, more than beauty. On the back of the box, they give you some store information about their official store and stuff like that. I really love this packaging, you guys. Like, this is some of the best packaging with the pink is. So, like I was saying, today, you guys, I will be going full blowing yes ma'am you guys this is the bow fox hair 20 inch water wave lace front wig in 613 blowing yes y'all it is a full blowing girl this is the hairline when it's straight from out of the bag the lace is transparent as you guys can see here is the wig cap size you guys it has a whole bunch of party space in the front so you can do whatever style you wanted to do it has four clips two up and down and two on the side you guys, I am very happy and excited to be installing this wig. I'm going to go do my own customizations, like plucking the hair and getting it ready to be installed. So I'll be jumping right back into the install. Okay guys, so now we're going to jump into the ball cap method. If you want to know my details on how I do the ball cap method in depth, you can go to one of my previous videos and you can see the details that I do about my whole ball cap method. Lately, I have been using my adhesive to lay my ball cap down. So now that you have applied your bow hole to your lace cap, you are going to wait until it dries clear. I can't believe I'm finna go blowing. Like, I think these are the longest nails I ever had, and it's like, hold up. They have changed my life. Okay, you guys, so this is my block cap method applied and everything is cut off. Now I am going to apply some makeup because you can still see the black from my hair. I'm going to take, oops, it be hair everywhere. I'm going to take a few squirts of my foundation. I'm going to tap, 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 and this is a beauty blender that I only use for my hair. Okay, so now we are going to jump into the install. Like, what the heck? Okay, so the first thing you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna check to see if you need to cut your ear hole. You're going to pull the lace evenly on both sides. And then if you need to cut your ear holes, you just take your eyebrow razor or your scissors and you go in where you need to cut your ear holes. Here is the ear hole cut. Um, my legs can lay perfectly in line with my ear. Okay, so next you're going to want to take your eyebrow razor and you're going to want to cut a slit right here in the middle of your lace. So once you have it folded back, you're going to begin applying your adhesive. I'm going to take my ghost blonde glue. I'm going to put a thin layer on the front of my wig cap and I'm going to wait for it to dry clear. Okay, so once you have your layer of glue, you're going to wait for it to dry clear. Y'all, I am so scared to put this blonde on. Like, I just hope it looks good. A lot of people say, oh, you should try blonde because blonde probably be cute. All right, we're finna see. Let's get it popping on my ladies. 
Did you hear what the fuck I said? Shake some air. Okay, so now that my layer has dried clear, we are going to begin the install. So I take one side of my flaps and I make sure all the hair is to the back. Then I grab the middle part and I grab my ear hole and I apply the ear hole to where it's supposed to be. So now that I have applied it to the glue, I'm going to begin to cut it off with my eyebrow razor. So I'm going to go in the middle flap and I'm going to take my eyebrow razor and I'm going to cut in a jagged line. So now that I have applied it, I'm going to move on to do my baby hairs and my last touches on my install and I'll be right back to show you guys the finished result. Okay, you guys, so this is the finished product using the Bow Fox Hair 613 20 inches in water wave. You guys, I love the turnout of this unit. Like, I'm about to go do a photo shoot. If you are interested in this unit, I will have it linked in the description box. The hair is super soft. It is super blonde, so when you want that blonde moment. If you guys want more color, let me know in the comments down below. I will definitely do more color for you guys. Make sure you like this video and subscribe so you don't miss any of my future uploads. Thank you guys again for tuning in. I'll see you in my next video.